All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, I got us some more, uh, oh, some more VR content I stumbled across. Um, you know, I love this American Truck Simulator and Euro Truck Simulator, both of them you're able to uh, actually play in VR. Uh, it's not even really a mod. It's actually, I guess, a beta. So, uh, yeah, it was kind of hidden. Uh, well, I'm sure a lot of people know about it, but, uh, but yeah, I just stumbled across it, so I figured I'd, uh, I'd share it and let everybody know uh, if you hadn't already seen it. Anyway, uh, so you gotta own American Truck Simulator or Euro Truck Simulator. Buy it on Steam. On it's pretty, pretty, pretty cheap. It goes on sale regularly. Uh, but yeah, once you get it, uh, just download it. First thing you wanna do once you download it is right click on it, go to properties. Uh, on this main page right here, get rid of this one right here. You don't want uh, desktop game theater. Get rid of that. <laughs> uh, then jump over to beta. You're gonna click and you're going to go down to this one right here. Uh, as of this video, it's 1.34 uh, SDK 1.4.0 right there. And then in this block right here, uh, there's two different little variations. Uh, one is for the Oculus. The other one is for the Vive and pretty, pretty much every other he headset. Uh, so you'll do dash open VR for everything else, the Vive. Uh, I believe any headset out there, um, and then for the Oculus, you do dash Oculus just like that, and then enter, and you're done. Um, anyway, it starts doing a the update, downloading it here, and uh, once it's done, you can jump right into the game. All right, so once you load into the game, uh, there's two uh, basically two options you have. Uh, you're gonna have a uh, black screen on your uh, desktop computer. Uh, which means that it's displaying in the headset, or you'll have this on the desktop. Change between those modes, you press F11. Look here, see this one kind of locked up right now. I can't move on the, on the uh, desktop, but I could access the menu um, in the headset. Anyway, so press F11 again. Here we go. Uh, so yeah, there's a couple things you want to change uh, just to make it run a little better. Go to options, graphics. Um, yeah, here's your, here's your graphic settings. Uh, easiest way to do it is just to click on Ultra and max everything out. Uh, but you want to change a couple things. Like the scaling here, it's 100%. Don't, you don't really need any of the other ones. The anti-aliasing, get rid of that. And the depth of field. Uh, pretty much everything else, uh, you can let, for the most part, test out. Apply that. Click yes. That should be about it. Um, next step will be, uh, well, jump in and actually drive. Yeah, and there you have it, guys. Uh, you know, when when you're in the game, I mean, it plays, you know, really well. Um, especially if you have a wheel and stuff. I, obviously, you can play with the gamepad. But uh, yeah, as far as in VR, it plays really well. You can, you know, as you can hear here, whoop, all over the road, but. <laughs> actually stick your head out the window um it's a lot of fun the one thing you do have to uh kind of kind of pay attention to uh is uh well the uh change your different views here i don't know what it does for you guys but ugh, that'll make you sick it doesn't really change it as far as in the headset um none of these so moving your head around when you're in any other view this one's this one seems to be fine um Ugh, that one's bad. This one's bad. That one's okay until you move your head. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, overall, uh, it's like I said, it's a full game, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, you know, thanks for watching the video. Uh, if you guys uh, know of any mods I should throw into this or any other VR games out there, or heck, any any VR games I should check out, you definitely just let me know, and and I'll uh, I'll definitely be sure to. <laughs> to uh, get back to you and get give them a shot uh i haven't been uh, playing vr as much as i've wanted to lately and just because there's so much content out, of, out there so anyway thanks for watching guys we will uh see you next time